what's going on everybody? In this video we are going to be breaking down Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2, Episode 10. Welcome to Venus Island. Let's get into it, talk about it, hit that intro Rangers. You are watching the fan club. You're watching the fan club. And you're watching the fan club. Do you know what time it is? And you know what time it is. It's time for the fan club. Let's go! Hey! Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to the fan club. It is your boy, Brosdan Brosnan, in the building. We are so happy to have you guys. In this video, we are going to be breaking down Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2, Episode 10. Welcome to Venus Island. This is another episode in that Green No More story arc that eventually is going to take the homie Tommy's powers away, which is part sad, but part exciting because we know what color comes after green. The White Ranger is coming. The White Tiger Zord is coming also. It is going to be a good time. Saba. I gotta say, the White Ranger suit has to be in like my top three all time favorite suits. So everyone's excited when he does get that upgrade. But let's talk about today's video. Let's get into it. In Welcome to Venus Island, the 10th episode of season two. Tommy, Kimberly, and Trini are building sandcastles with Trini's neighbor, Hallie, at the beach, where Bulk and Skull are also lurking, disguised as putties in an attempt to lure out the Power Rangers and discover their identities. However, their plan backfires when they accidentally destroy a small boy's sandcastle, earning them a kick in the leg from the boy. Meanwhile, Lord Zed is displeased with Bulk and Skull's mockery of his putties and decides to send his own putties to the beach to capture Hallie, intending to use her as a lesson to the rangers. The three friends find Hallie being held captive by Goldar and the putties, and they vanish before they can do anything. The rangers receive an encoded message from Lord Zed, which Billy decodes revealing that Halley is being taken to Venus Island, a mystical island that only exists when Lord Zed calls it forth. The rangers devise a plan to track the island using a device that Billy builds, and eventually they locate Halley and teleport to Venus Island to rescue her. However, they are confronted by the monster even usable flytrap which captures four of the rangers and Lord Zed demands that Tommy surrender in exchange for their release. Tommy refuses and Trini comes up with a plan to rescue Hallie and the others, but Tommy insists on taking Hallie's place, fearing that he may lose control of his powers again. Just as Tommy is about to leave, Alpha 5 discovers that even usable fly trap has a weakness to heat, and the rangers use this to their advantage, generating heat from their power coins within the monster and destroying it. With the monster defeated, the rangers hurry to rescue Halley before Venus Island sinks into the sea, and they eventually succeed in saving her. The episode ends with Bulk and Skull attempting to uncover the Rangers' identities by questioning Halley, but their plan backfires once again and the Rangers' identities remain safe. It is getting real close episode to episode. You'd think that they're going to get their identities given away, which I don't understand how nobody puts it together. Like, I know it's a TV show, but holy crap, it is... Under everyone's nose, they're wearing the corresponding color to their ranger. They're all like in shape, athletic. They're all doing good all the time. Like, wouldn't these guys be the perfect Power Rangers? Like, if you were on the outside looking in and you just were at school with these guys every day, but they didn't really know you, but you're just kind of following them. Yeah, you could tell real quick these guys are the damn Power Rangers just very surprising nobody knew you know we made a short video a few months ago talking about how ernie knows deep down now obviously nothing ever confirmed it but it just makes sense that if anybody knows it's ernie dang it overall this was a very fun episode of power rangers i call these all fun i don't want to say they're good they're bad they're early 90s shows with a cheap budget inexperienced actors one of like 
the cheapest action sequences they can make, but yet they're still so much fun, man. I have a lot of good memories now going down memory lane. Like, we're making some new memories going back down this and talking with the fans and listening to you guys, what you guys liked about these episodes. These are a lot of fun. I like how Goldar is still badass as of right now. Like, he didn't turn into a comedic character just yet. Lord Zed is up in the ante this year when it comes to a villain all of his plans are a little bit more darker, a little bit more twisted. This is a great start to the season. We hate that, you know, the cast is going to change soon and it's going to change the storyline and kind of throw a wrench into a few things, which is expected. It's not like the new cast members that are coming in are bad by any means. It's just season two right now is probably at its peak. Once you get to the power transfer and stuff like that, it, there is a different vibe. But overall, I think most fans would agree season three is probably one of the best seasons because there's more character development. There's a lot more better storyline, stuff like that. Season two, I felt like it was starting to go that way. But halfway through the season, we had to change everything one time for the fun time. So what are your guys' thoughts? I'm really enjoying this first part of season two. I love you guys so much. Shout out all the fans out there that take the time out of their day to watch this channel. You are the real MVPs and the reason why we can continue to make content like this. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time. Peace. I want to take a second to shout out all of the Gold Ranger members, the Arctic Operator, Roderick Ham, Papillon Purple, Salima Ramirez, Steven Heffelman, Chaos Draco, Thomas Franco, Anime King Nick, Lewis Cairns, Sean Schiffer, and Torrent Dark Gray. Thank you guys so much for your support, and if you want a video shout out like this one, sign up to be a Gold Ranger member today. I just want to shout out all of the fans out there for taking the time out of their day to watch this content. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you can, please like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and hit that share button. And if you guys want to be a member, click that join button right now. We have a Bloom Ranger your membership that gets you into the exclusive fan chat discord then we have the gold ranger membership it gets you into the fan chat but you also get a video shout out at the end of every video i want to thank you guys again if you can sign up to be a member we will see you next time peace hi hi we're bulk and skull we, we have are been requested, requested by, by the, the fan club, club to say, say something funny. Funny!